Welcome to another episode of the Kin Seed series, and we've officially passed the 100th episode of the series. If you missed the last episode, you should certainly check it out. It looks over all 100 episodes, basically. Uh, it was a lot of fun to see how much things have changed since we started playing. So, But for this episode, we need to get a sickle. You need a sickle to harvest wheat or to cut through long gra grass. Our old sickle rusted, so we need a new one. Jeremy Irons in the village should be able to help. Thanks, father. Anything else to say? The Vale is full of decent folk, even the lady with all the cats. Though you might want to hold your nose if you pay her a visit. Whole place is a litter box. <laughs> Gross. Anything else? I do miss your Aunt Rose, so... But she's in a better place now, right by Druida's side. Ever since I started count courting her, I knew she was too special to keep for it to myself, I suppose. Oh. We've had some bad years on the farm, I won't lie. That time we had a drought was no picnic. In the summer, the whole vale was attacked by locusts was even worse. But as long as we make summer tide a success, I'm sure things will turn out fine this year. He doesn't have any more question marks. Ash Brown. A friendship means a lot. Ooh, an infling. Nice. Seems about right. Uh, was that the only one? No. We've got a couple actually. Teresa. Friendship means a lot. Strawberries! Ooh, and you get strawberries too. And from Clay, we got Beast Tail. Uh, okay. And then from Lucy. A recipe! Pick a pike pie. Pike, flour, and eggs. Yes. That's something I'm hopeful we'll get more of uh, in this save is um, more recipes. So I'm not sure if we missed those like milestones, if we'll never get those recipes. Uh, because they weren't in the game when we hit the milestone. There you go, little buddy. Sorry, hopefully he hasn't been waiting too long for that water. So our sibling had something to say. Uncle Bill seems very kind to you. I often think about our real parents. I can't remember them at all. You must have been given away when very young. Do you think they were too poor to feed us? Did they die fighting monsters? Were we bad children? We will never truly know. Surprised our uncle doesn't know. Tomato! And we got a water. Oh, and the pig ate. Took it a bit. <laughs> oh, we don't have a map of this area. Uh, that looks really looks like somewhere you should be able to go. Guess I better find that map stone. Need some primrose. Hey! Map to the region. Oh, nice! It has little question marks if you haven't been to those locations. So if I've been down to... Testy Acres? Dang it. Moss Whisper Ruin. God, I never remember about this place. <laughs> so it must mean that uh, um, Testy is down, I think. Here? Ooh. If that's the case, then I don't remember what that is. <laughs> Mushrooms! Grab that. I'm a fun guy. Mapstone one. Mushrooms and a note. Grab that. And see what this says. If you want some extra peg, go to work on an egg. Pretty area. Oh, a note. On the day of worship, seek a withered tree in secret deep. I wonder if that's about getting like the little sap on uh, Goddess Day. If it'll give us better stats. Oh, I almost missed this guy. Chicken makes your muscles strong, heals and makes your dog's tongue long. And a note. 
Squirrels dripped in luscious candy makes a friendship very handy. If you're careful. <laughs> Sometimes it's a trap. Map stone. Poisonous is the rotting flesh of apples that once were fresh. I had to read that a couple times because it kept swipping, swapping two of the words. Okay. <laughs> Ooh, a note down there. Let's go get it. Hello. Candied hair is very sweet. Buy from shops, so use your feet. I just, let's see, if we walk away, is it gone now? Not quite. They may refresh when you enter onto the maps. Uh, let's see. I don't wonder what that area is. Ooh. Intriguing. I wonder. Yeah, I don't know how you would get up there. It looks like maybe somewhere you would teleport to. There's like no direct path. That's exciting. And so it looks like we got that map filled and checked out. So now I'm curious to go down to uh, Testy Acres and then see what's attached to it. Okay, so this is here. Grab our monument stone. Hey there, Warzel. Gift. Dang it. Oh wait, maybe that was alright. That was alright. This doesn't make things totally right. Whew. So we're neutral. Thought I'd gotten a one he hated. And I was like, no! <laughs> uh, hello buddy. Have an apple. Still neutral. Looks like we haven't talked to Jed. Or I think we might have talked to Jed, but not Ned, and they just swapped, maybe? Gift... I should know this. Cabbage? Hello! Oh, friendship up. It doesn't make things totally right. So, was that something that he liked? Yes. Whew, I'm glad I remembered. Alright, so yeah, they swapped. Hey, Ned. Dad doesn't like me talking with people, but just wanted to say welcome to the Vale. Is it true you're also a twin? If they're as dunce-brained as mine, you have my commiseration. <laughs> uh, here's an apple. How'd you know I like such things? I didn't. <laughs> Gossip. You should try Poppy Hill Goods Store if you are a fan of baked goods. They do a pie with pastry so light that you could float over a quill after eating one. Sounds lovely. Uh, a lovely poem to uh, Druida. To avoid the bugs when they're about, build your being with river trout. Hmm. We've got our their box here. Don't forget you can fast travel via the goddess stones or other methods. Alright. I shall not forget. Another book. Ah, this is the first book by Kane Hines, our dog lover. And Mapstone. Yay! Do they have a goddess stone? Ooh. Come back to that. Ooh. Wow, that's a sneaky note. When the land is sprinkled white, blood fuse sh shirks and takes flight. I don't know if we're going to be able to make it to the blacksmith today. Let's hope we do. No. Hello, hello there, young one. Hmm. All out of sickles, I'm afraid, but I'm also afraid of going into the mine to dig for ore, which is why we're out of sickles. I heard some knocking, so I got straight out of there. But I'll tell you what, here's the key to the mine. If you're brave enough to get your own ore, pop back into the smithy and I'll show you how to make your own sickle. Goddesses go with you, because I surely aren't. <laughs> Thanks. You'll find the mine behind our house, which is up and left from the smithy. You probably wouldn't run into any knockers, but just in case. It was nice knowing you. Oh no. It's reassuring. Uh, Jeffrey? Is that your name? God, he looks so weird young. Jeffrey, babe. Best be careful in that mine. It's a healthy and safety- <laughs> It's a health and safety nightmare, that place. Reassuring, once again. Head into the mine we go. Let's get the 
this guy on. Dinner. And a note over there. Okay, we've got a book. A plea. Ah, uh, yes. This is about the, the the knockers. And if you find these notes, please tell my wife, Patty. Ooh, we're in the burial grounds. Ooh, blood view. Come back. Turn around. Yes. Now back through the mine. We're gonna pass out soon. Got a note. Put an apple in fairy rings and rot it will like darkest things. Mm. Don't know why we'd want that. Certainly have enough bad apples on my own. I haven't gotten any rotten apples yet. It's the gassy apples that I have a lot of. And where is this taking us? Cow pet. Cabbage looks and tastes so dull, but it doesn't half make you pull. Alright, uh, I'm trying to- no map. Alright. Shall I leave this place? I'm trying to think of the fastest way we could get home. So we've got like an hour to get there. It's probably here, then across. I'll talk to you tomorrow, sir. Oh, is that a fairy's path? Where is the goddess statue? Down there. North gate will be quicker. It's a race against time. Cutting through the fields. We're gonna at least be on the farm. Run! Run like the wind! No! Don't get. Dang it! I mean, I wouldn't have been able to get anywhere, but it was sad to get stuck. Alright. Whistles. Hello, sibling. You wanna hear about the dream I had? It's a bit fuzzy now, but I was walking through the woods and this voice kept tell talking to me. I think it said I was going to live forever. Isn't that silly? It is. It is good to be helping out Uncle Bill. I think the farm's been getting too much for him. I hope I never get old like that. I think the previous statement might have uh, helped with that. Remember how we used to play ba cluck oink at the shoe? We haven't done it in ages. Fancy a game now. Sure. Alright then. After three, choose ba, cluck, or oink. Remember, ba beats Cluck, cluck beats oink, and oink beats ba. First to five wins. I am the best, so if you win, I will give you a candy squirrel. I don't think... I don't like nuts anyway. Ready? Uh... Cluck. Ba. I win. Dang it. Oink. I feel like you're cheating! I won one! A draw. I win. We're tied now. I win. No. They win. Don't feel bad. I'm the Quillian champ. My mind is like a shield of steel, don't you think? Yeah. I was just randomly clicking. Today is just an ordinary day, really. Just like any other. Have you been to the notice board in the village? It's just opposite the goods store. It's worth checking there to see if there's any of the villagers needing some help. Well, you're down there. It's pig auction day. We can't afford a new pig, but why don't you nip down to the auction stall in Festival Green and get some experience? Remember when I was your age, didn't much care for all this talk of goddess and such. Then I made an offering at one of the statues and found a brass coin that very day. It was the one I'd lost the day before, but still. Such a shame you never got to try your Aunt Rose's cooking. The things she could do with a turnip. Like cooking it until it was ready to eat. <laughs> well, that's good. I was quite the fisherman back in my day. This My specialty is awful's tench. Uh, tricky little buggers, let me tell you. Of course, they there were more of them around back then. Maybe I caught too many. 
Uh, sorry. I wanted to throw an apple in here. And in here. Water our crop. Oh, they're ready. Alright, I got all the things collected. Let's get these couple planted. There we go. Give it a good water. And we're off to town to make a sickle. First, I want to see what's attached to uh, Testy Acres. I went the wrong path for that though, so I guess we'll be doing this first. But I do want to finish off by going uh, and seeing what that is. Hello? Anybody here? If oh, there's a chicken egg. And chickens eat eggs. Or uh, apples. <laughs> Hope they don't eat eggs. There you guys go. Waiting for these guys to get back where they need to be. Ah, he was turning the shop sign. Well, drop an anvil on my toe. Here you are alive and with a pocket full of ore. You've learned a lesson in the noble art of smithing, that's for sure. Get a hold of the chain on that forge and we'll get started. A mold for blacksmithing. Let's begin your smithing apprenticeship. Start by selecting the ore and the mold. You only have tin and the sickle mold, but there will be more materials and molds out there to create anything from door knockers to swords. Alright, we've got our tin, we've got our sickle, bellows. Oh, it's so quiet. Uh, now you need to cool it to make it durable. Hold down the left mouse button to plunge the sickle in and let go when you see the arrow hit the target line. It move fa moves fast, so be ready. Nice. Good. Now you need to set your flexibility in the forge. Hold the left mouse button to improve flexibility. The more you have, the easier it'll be when it comes to the anvil. Alright. Uh, good. Okay. Now we need to hammer the sickle on the anvil. Uh, press left mouse button when the hammer passes over the target to hit it. Having higher flexibility in the previous stage means slower moving hammer. Alright, every time you successfully hit, your dur durability rises. Alright. Oops. Hey. Well done. Now grind the item to sharpen it. Hold left mouse button to start the grinding process and let go to stop the markers to the line. One for each side, so try to be accurate on both. Ooh. Alright. Yeah. Used by serial killers. The sickle. Talk to him. Well done. You've made a f you will make a fine smith. If you want to do an apprenticeship, then just talk to me. You are welcome to start anytime, but you do need to provide the ore. It will pay you per item you make. One day you might even make something as great as the hammer my father gave me as an heirloom. I dare I daren't use it as it is so precious. Oh, still question mark. Great. Well, like I said, if you provide the ore, then we can make as much as you want. Come talk to me when you you've made anything and I'll pay you for the item. Good. Okay. Nope, can't go that way. Alright, let's head out this way. It's good to have a sickle again. Let's get that equipped. God, I'm not sure where I used to keep that. Maybe there. Who knows? Crumble chalk mine. Okay. I knew it was the area where you go to see Fairweather uh, at the beginning the first time around. But I kind of forget what it is besides that. If we can find the map stones real quick. I am running out of- oh we need to interact that. I am running out of recording time. So let's see what we can do. Alright, got a stone activated. Hopefully I haven't missed many of those. Hopefully guys you'll tell me if I uh, miss one. <laughs> When your energy is gone, Apple can help you still go on. And a map stone. 
I think this area is fairly small, yeah. Basically just those two mines. Alright, and there's not even all that many uh, notes in the, the overworld at least. Kukudu can be found by tree stumps with blue flowers around. Let's get a uh, light on. Pretty straightforward mine this one. Just some more. Alright. So, I think that's going to be it for this episode. We managed to go and make our sickle after collecting ore. Uh, we got to talk to our father and sibling a whole lot. We mapped a couple of regions, so that's all been very good. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this episode, and until next time, I hope you have a wonderful day.